Hey guys, how you doing? Dave here. If you have some leftover mashed potatoes from the holidays, a great idea is to roll them up into balls, put some cheese in the middle, and, fr and deep fry them up. You're gonna love this. Let me walk you through it, and let's get started. First off, I'm gonna start by peeling the potatoes. And you can use, you know, whatever potato you like. I'm just using white, but, you know, you can use Yukon Jack, whatever you like. Then we're just going to cut them into, oh, I'd say smaller sections. Put them into a pot of boiling water. And this is going to take about, oh, I'd say 15, 20 minutes. So while the potatoes are boiling, let's put up our Christmas tree balls. See, we're talking about balls. And I'm just going to add these on here. Doesn't this look pretty? Now the question is, what do you decorate your tree with and what do you put up, what, what time do you put up your tree? What date? I always put mine up, you know, three or four weeks before Christmas. And I think we'll just add this one to here. And maybe this one, what do you think? Down here maybe? And I'm going to add some Christmas lights. And these are blinking lights. So you're going to see them blink now. Like, I think I got them in the wrong place. Uh oh. Oh well, we'll get them back in the tree. Don't worry about it. So now that potatoes are tender, I can pierce them with a fork. So I'm just going to kill the heat and I'm going to strain them. Now I'm going to put them into a bowl. Do a bit of smash and mash here. Just so until they're kind of mashed down. Add in half a cup of mayo. About half a teaspoon of salt. And of course my all time favorite, some ground black pepper. And I'm gonna grab up my masher again and mix this up. Mmm, this tastes really good. So what I've got here is a fairly small ice cream scoop. So I'm going to scoop up, oh, a couple of scoops. Kind of form it into a ball. Then what we're going to do is flatten it out. Then what I've got here is a mixture of mozzarella and sharp cheddar. You can use a Tex-Mex as well. And just kind of put some into the center gather all the edges and just kind of roll it back into a ball. Dredge it up in some cornstarch. I'm just going to kind of roll this around and set it aside. So we're going to fry these in batches in oil about 350 degrees. And what we're going to do here is rotate them around just until they're golden browns. These are going to be so yummy. So what you want is a nice golden brown color, something like this. Now what I'm going to do is remove these and set them aside. Now they're beautifully done. I'm going to sprinkle some parsley over the top just for some color. And there you have it guys, our potato cheese balls. So let's give this a taste test. Mmm, so good. Potatoey, cheesy, combination of spices. You're gonna love this. 
So the full information is on the blog. Head over to on to cookandshare.com. All kinds of cool stuff over there. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, and we'll see you later.